What was called funk art included a broad range of things, um, much of which had to do with social commentary and political commentary. We think of Bob Arneson. There are very few artists whose works on the surface call attention to them, make you interested in who they were, who they are, etc. Arneson was one of these people. Arneson had the gut to make himself his own subject, carrying that self-importance up to unspeakably obscene levels and gorgeous, glorious levels. Arneson to me was almost like Peck's bad boy. You know, anything he could do to cause a controversy of some sort and say, geez, I made, look at the controversy I'm causing over a lousy little piece of art. But Arneson seemed always to take ideas which we didn't face directly and force us to think about them. 